AWS is one of the most trending IT job nowadays guys. In the future also, AWS developer is most demanding job guys. So in this session, I am going to discuss about how to become an AWS developer and what are the prerequisites to become an AWS developer. And also we will know what, and what are the list of AWS certifications available and how much experience is required to do those certifications. So we will discuss all those things in this session guys. So watch till the end of the video then you can understand how to become an AWS developer and what are the mandatory skills to survive in IT industry as an AWS developer. Okay. So before moving to the main topic, if you have visited our YouTube channel for the first time, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel guys. So I will, so I used to upload more and more useful content videos guys. And don't forget to share to your friends also guys. Okay, so let's come back into the main topic. So how to become, how to become an AWS developer? And what are the prerequisites to learn AWS developer? So you must know some basic understanding of operating system guys. Either it is Windows or Linux or Unix or any operating systems basic understanding is required. And also if you have knowledge on basic network concepts like TCP, IP, routers, gateways, firewalls. Okay, so if you know all these network basic concepts then it, then it is a very added advantage guys. So therefore, who are already working experience in Linux administrator or any system administrator, then those people easily become AWS cloud developer guys or even DevOps engineer as well. Okay, so if you are very strong in Linux administration or system administration skills, then you can easily learn uh, cloud related technologies guys. So mainly you must know some basic knowledge of operating systems, networking concepts and also some virtualization concept guys. Now let's understand what are the main skills they will cover while you are learning uh, AWS concept. First they will uh, give introduction about uh, cloud computing concepts guys. What is cloud computing? What are, what are the advantages of cloud computing? What are the different types of uh, uh, cloud computing? What is the architecture of cloud computing? Okay, and uh, uh, private cloud, public cloud, hybrid cloud. Okay, they will explain, they will explain all the fundamentals concept of cloud computing. So after learning the fundamentals of cloud computing, here the main concepts are start guys. So the first one is AWS services. You should know the AWS services like AWS EC2, AWS EC2, Elastic, Lambda, so they will explain. These are the mandatory skills guys to become an AWS developer. AWS services, mandatory skills. Okay, and then storage services. One storage services is mandatory to become an AWS cloud developer. Okay, so that is nothing but S3, EFS. S3 and EFS. This is one of the most used storage service in cloud computing environment okay and then networking services like vpc cdns cloud front load balancers these are the majorly used network related services like vp vpc cdn cloud front okay so after learning these concepts next database concepts also you should learn these concepts also to become an AWS developer. Okay, so mainly for AWS developer, you should know Redshift, DynamoDB, RDS. You must be strong in DynamoDB or Redshift. Okay, so major uh, MLC companies all are preferred, are recommended to learn uh, DBMS concept for AWS developer is nothing but Redshift or DynamoDB. After that, you should know AWS Glue and, and AWS Athena concepts, guys. Okay, so after that, uh, you should know any one uh, scripting uh, programming, like it might be shell scripting or JavaScript or Python, anyone. If you have coding knowledge, it is a very added advantage, guys. 
and also if you know uh, spark or high spark that is also one of the major added advantage uh, to get high package as a aws developer okay so after that uh, you should know one monitoring tool as well like cloud watch okay so if you know all these concepts then you can become a aws developer then you may doubt how much duration takes to complete this aws developer course so it might take uh, four to six months guys to learn all these concepts now let's uh, now let's talk about uh, what are the different types of uh, aws certifications available and who is eligible to do these certification how much experience is required in aws to do these certifications you may have doubt guys there are uh, three levels of uh, aws certifications are available fundamentals associate and professional certifications available in aws guys then who are eligible to do uh, these aws certifications suppose if you are a uh, aws beginner candidate and you, sh you you just have six months of experience in the cloud in the aws cloud environment mm -hmm. then, then better to do aws certified cloud practitioner guys this is for beginners this certification is for beginners guys below six months of experience candidate and uh, to do this certification the cost is uh, 100 dollars guys okay the next level of certification is associate level certification guys who are more than one years of experience in the cloud technologies environment those candidates are eligible to do these certifications okay so there are also different types of uh, aws certified uh, associate uh, uh, certification available like uh, aws certified developer certification AWS certified solution architect certification, AWS certified sys OPS administration certification. Okay, so uh, this associate level certification cost is $150, guys. And the next level of certification is a professional certification, guys, who have more than four years or five years of experience in the cloud related technologies. Those candidates are eligible, and also you must have done the associate certification guys to do professional certification okay so and this professional certification cost is uh, 300 dollars guys and there are also some other uh, specialty aws certifications also available guys uh, based on their domains suppose if you are uh, machine learning side then there is a certification available available like uh, aws uh, certified machine learning specialty Suppose if you are in uh, uh, database side or big data side, then AWS certified uh, big data specialty. Suppose you are in security side, AWS certified uh, security uh, specialty. Suppose if, we, if you are in networking side, AWS certified advanced networking specialty. So there are some other specialty certifications also there for uh, AWS related certification but mainly as a aws developer if you done if you done aws certified developer certification then your resume will be more weightage guys okay so these are the main skills guys to become an aws developer that's all guys my side so if you feel this video is very helpful please share to your friends also guys and don't forget to hit the like button and we'll meet with one more useful content video. So thank you very much.